Peace, peace, peace. This your brother Monroe Jr. So the source of this report is TMZ. And uh, prosecutors want Bill Cosby in prison on Monday after sentencing. And the prosecutors now fear that if they don't put their foot down and demand that he begin spending the term behind bars, he would never see a prison cell. And uh, 81 year old entertainment icon is facing a maximum of, of 30 years in the binge, but given his ability to push for an appeal and the resources that he has to pay bail and remain far from a correctional facility, it is quite possible that he could live his last days as free as he has since the judge overseeing the proceedings ruled that he may remain confined to his residence leading up to this week's sentencing. And then on Saturday, TMZ reported that their authorities closed, uh, excuse me, that a authorities close to the case have expressed that such an arrangement won't cut it for those invested in seeing Cosby brought to justice in that constrained team. Excuse me. So as we can see, we know it's a double standard when it comes to black and white entertainers and celebrities in this country i mean harvey weinstein who is allegedly facing life hasn't seen a jail cell i mean even if you look at ben uh, roethlisberger the quarterback for the steelers who uh was accused of rape in 2008 in a penthouse and then his own wife uh, Miss Miss Daniels, uh, Stephanie Clifford wrote that, uh, you know, they she had an encounter uh, with uh, Roethlisberger uh, a night after she had relations with Donald Trump because Donald Trump and Ben are, are, are friends or, or were friends at that time, and uh, Ben requested a good night kiss. And she denied the goodnight kiss and he allegedly pushed her into a hotel room and she was just saying how she was she was terrified you know and that Ben kept saying come on come on and uh, she was saying after she closed the uh, closed the door that he stood outside not leaving and knocked several times and we know that Ray Rice, he hit his wife and he, he can't even play no more. The black brother, right? So it's a, it's a double standard. And oh, let's not forget Charlie Sheen, you know, who was uh, infecting people with the HIV. And he was held for coming clean about doing so. And uh, that actress and director, Asia uh, Argentino, who... Uh, or, or Argento, excuse me, who's part of the Me Too movement. Uh, she was among the first women in the business to publicly accuse and disclose that the producer Harvey Weinstein sexually assaulted her, but then she got accused, right, of sexual assault and, and, and uh, privately quietly arranged to pay her own accuser 300 uh no i'm sorry thirty thousand dollars jimmy bennett who uh was a, another young actor in rock musician so it's like the hypocrisy when it comes to hollywood the hypocrisy when it comes to white america in their selective outrage in whom they try to vilify in the media and whom their judicial systems try to uh, attack when it comes to black men. So uh, hopefully everything will work out for uh, Brother Cosby. I do not support anyone in rape, right? But it just seems like it was a bunch of allegations with no actual facts. So uh, you know, our creator is the best Noah. If he did it, he does deserve to sit in a cell. Any man that takes from a woman what a woman is not willing to give to us and we take pleasure from her and she's not willing to give it to us, I don't care if you're the, the husband, the, whatever. If she says no, don't take from her, man.
and, and vice versa, sisters. If a man says he does not want to engage in sexual relations, none of us have the right to take from another human being what they are not willing to give. This your brother Monroe Jr. I'm signing off. Peace.